What I'm going to show you today will cut your video editing time by more than half. Some while ago I teamed up with Submagic who is also sponsoring this video. They've got this cool web-based AI tool that does more than just captions with one click. It also throws in b-rolls for your videos and a bunch of other great stuff. But the captions you get with Submagic are not the classic ones. They have prepared the trending captions so famous people like Mr. Beast, Alex Hermosi, Iman Ghazi and others are using. So today I'm going to walk you through a few easy steps in Submagic that will cut down your editing time and help you make some pro looking videos. So the first you need to go to submagic.co and sign up for free. Once you're in, click on this new video icon. It will open up a pop-up window where you can upload your video. Then you can choose your spoken language from a drop-down menu and click on upload. Give it a few seconds to generate the video. Here comes the best part. You can choose a different captions templates from famous people like I told you before. You can go even with Devin Lato style, Iman Gadzi or Ali Abdal. But for my case I will use Harmozi's second style which I like most. You can then position the captions up or down but I usually place them just a little under the middle line. If you want to change the color of the highlighted text, you can also do that for main, second and third color. I will just change the third color to blue. Now because my native language is not English, I have to check all the words if they were spelled right. You can do that by going to captions and check all the words if there is any mistake. I found one and I'm going to fix it. Click on it and change the text. or click on it and you can move it up to a previous line or you can just delete it if you don't need it there. There is also a very cool feature if you go to trim and turn on this remove silence toggle button. That will remove the silence parts of your video. If we go back you will see that I stopped talking at around 8 second mark. So if we go to trim and turn on the remove silence button, we will get rid of the silence parts in our video. Let's see how it did that. I got a lot of requests from you guys to make a map animation tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to do exactly that. Pretty cool. It shortened my video because it removed the silence parts with just one click. That is awesome. If you want to replace the emojis that were created automatically, you can do that by going to captions, find the emoji, click on it and replace it with the one that you like. You can also add a sound effect that goes with that emoji. Just click on that sound icon and find the one you like and click on it to apply it. Let's hear what that sounds. A request from you guys to make a map animation tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to do exactly that. Perfect! Now you can really level up your videos with some b-rolls. And you can do that really quick and easy by going to b-roll, click on add and choose or find the one from the library which is supported by Storyblocks. Or if you want to use your own b-roll, you can go to my b-rolls and upload your own b-roll. I already imported mine. You can then set the start of the b-roll by clicking on this time icon. Find the start time, so in my case that is at around 3 second mark and it ends around 5 second of the video and then click on apply. There are also a cool transitions that you can use here, either for your b-roll or your original video. For this case I will use a zoom out transition for this b-roll. When you are happy with everything, you can go to publish and add some music background to your clip. Click on the music toggle, add and upload your music file. Click on the file, hit apply and listen how it sounds. I got a lot of requests from you guys to make a map animation tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to do 
If the music is too loud and you don't hear your voice, you can decrease it by dragging this volume slider down. Submagic also added this amazing new feature called hook title and if you turn this on, the AI will generate the hook title for your video. You can then also customize this title by changing the color of the text, font of the text, size and position. When you are happy with everything, you can just go to export and click on export. You will then get an email once your video is ready and from there you can download your video. I got a lot of requests from you guys to make a map animation tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to do exactly that. At the end, let us just quickly check the pricing. You can start with free trial version which comes with watermark, then you can upgrade to starter, pro or agency if you are a company. But because I've partnered with Submagic, I managed to get 10% discount for you guys if you use my code RENE10. So I hope this video was helpful, take care and see you in the next one.